Progedy, eat no evil bars, are the subject of today's food for thought. My name is Jodie Bunting and this is another one of our live health tip videos to help you lose weight. Now today we are going to be reviewing these. Now these are called Progedy bars uh, and their strap line is eat no evil. Uh, yesterday we were sharing uh, some information about some of the health bars. Um, and basically, one of the big uh, selling points here is no refined sugars. Uh, they're also vegan as well, so they contain vegan chocolate. This one is the Chunky Chocolate Reborn. And this one is the Dark Chocolate and Sea Salt. So that one really attracts me. Um, you know, that lovely deep chocolate flavours with a little bit of sea salt as well. Uh, they're made in the United Kingdom, so it's a nice local company. Um, and let's have a little look at the nutritional information. First of all, of the chunky chocolate one, uh, per 35 gram bar, there's 193 calories in one of these. Uh, so it is a little bit high compared to the low calorie bars. As I said previously, these contain some nutrients. Therefore, if you wanted to have this as a meal instead, then maybe this is the sort of place it fits into your uh, eating plan. Uh, so the ingredients, organic cocoa butter, organic raw cocoa nibs, uh, organic coconut sugar, gluten-free oat, inulin, I don't know what that is, organic hazel, hazelnut paste. Wow, that sounds amazing, doesn't it? A bit of hazelnut paste. Uh, raw legume, I don't know what that is. Coconut oil, cocoa solids, um, and that's basically it. So the, the ingredient list isn't that massive, to be honest with you. Um, before we taste these... Let's have a little look at the other one, see how that does in comparison. So this is the dark chocolate and salt. This one is the chunky chocolate one. So again, this bar is 184 calories. So this one's a little bit lower. Obviously, that's because it's got the milk chocolate and this one's got the dark chocolate in. Um, and ingredients wise, this one has raw cocoa nibs, cocoa butter, cocoa sugar, um, basically exactly the same as the other one, but this one's got 0.3% uh, sea salt. So I'm interested to find where they're actually getting their chocolate flavours from. It's obviously just the, the cocoa butter and the nibs. This one has got more cocoa butter in, so obviously that's making it more creamy. And this one, the highest ingredient is the cocoa nibs. You never heard had cocoa nibs are. Uh, they're literally bits of raw uh, chocolate or cocoa. Um, and they're quite tasty. Right, I'm going to go with the chunky chocolate one first because I, I don't. I think this one's going to be my favourite. So let's have that one at the end. So, oh. Oh, wow. It doesn't look like how I was going to imagine at all. I thought it was going to be like one of those other fruit things. It actually looks like a big chocolate bar, doesn't it? Oh. I'm really surprised at that. You know what? That is really gorgeous. It's basically a vegan chocolate bar without prepping it. That is really delicious. I don't know about you, but I love eating chocolate for breakfast as well. <laughs> uh, this one is the sea salt and dark chocolate. Right, harder. Definitely more bitter in a good way, but still a rich chocolate flavour. I would definitely recommend those. And as I said, because it's got the coconut in, it's not just like a normal chocolate bar, which is full low quality fats and sugar 
it's also got coconut sugar in. And it doesn't even taste that chocolatey. Uh, sorry, that coconut. It actually just tastes like chocolate. I'm really surprised at how good that is. Uh, so as I said, these are the Progeny Eat No Evil Vegan Chocolate Bars. Give them a go.